Beyond Price is a collection of philosophical essays about the ethics of birth and death. Should we be glad to have been born? Should we be afraid of dying? When we bring a new person into existence by having a child, are we doing good? Giving the gift of life, as it is sometimes called? If we decide to end our own lives by choosing assisted suicide, are we doing wrong? Do we have obligations to our biological children? And can they be transferred to other custodial parents if we are able to discharge them ourselves? Do we have obligations to ourselves to preserve our own lives? And can those obligations be waived? I think that to be born is not to receive a gift, but to be thrown into a predicament that will lead to wonderful things if we manage to cope with it, and terrible things if we don't. The help we need to cope with the predicament of human life is owed to us by the people who threw us into it, our biological parents. And I think that they have unique resources to help, and so they cannot transfer their parental obligations to others, unless, of course, they are unable to fulfill them. My conclusion is that anonymous donation of sperm and eggs and the creation of children with them is simply immoral. As for assisted suicide, I think that although there are circumstances in which we are entitled to assistance in dying, they are circumstances in which our capacity to make the decision on our own is compromised, and so it should not be described as suicide. Help in dying must be a collective decision involving others. My conclusions are controversial. They may even seem perverse. I don't seek out perverse conclusions. I'm not a contrarian. But I don't find philosophy interesting when it merely confirms what I already believed. I would rather think about the questions on which it can surprise me. As Bertrand Russell said, the point of philosophy is to start with something so simple as not to seem worth stating, and to end with something so paradoxical that no one will believe it. Arguing for the obvious is not worth a philosopher's time.